James Williams works with him. And here's Kevin Martin. Yeah, the third time the T-Wolves have been to the free throw line. 22 of the first meeting here in Minnesota, including five from downtown. And the great job on Love. Martin hears the whistle as he's cutting across the paint. Well, the T-Wolves very good at yelling also when they hit. Sun's getting into uh, some difficulty here in the guard position. Bledsoe and now Green, each with a pair of fouls. Well, that was going to be a key coming into this game, Steve, as far as trying to keep the Wolves off the free throw line. They shot, shot 67 free throws in those first two games against the Suns, and it's just something you can't allow, and that's what keeps them in the game. Suns team that likes to run, and if Minnesota's going to the free throw line all the time, it just slows the game down. Love nearly stripped by Green, and that's a three ball by Martin. Kevin Martin, 39%. Starting the last three with Pekovic out with a sore ankle. Comes off a 22-point, 21-rebound game and a loss at Houston. Does Chang and Martin plus the foul. Good start here for the T-Wolves. Yeah, big start going to the free throw line. And Kevin Martin goes to the line. Well, as much as and this one. Is, as much, Steve, as this is a running team. Markeith Morris, Morris again, he brought it out and saw that Bledsoe was open in the corner. Bled has five, his first three and two attempts. And the Suns within 14 after trailing by 22. Rubio, twisting and turning. Martin puts it on the floor. Well, Martin does a good job. So we begin the second half like we did the first half, frantically. Yeah, it was a tough break for the Suns. They looked like they had a break opportunity and Channing Fry couldn't unleash it. Martin with that unorthodox delivery. But into the hands of Brewer. Here comes Rubio. Now, how is Brewer able to get that ball when he was jumping? He's faster. I thought than that was. I thought that was illegal. He's faster than a speeding bullet. Maybe he didn't jump. But still, the jumper is not allowed. First, man. That, yeah, that was. Unless uh, they've changed that rule. Odd. Well, exactly. I mean. It, <laughs> It seems and that's how you start, th so that ball should have gone back. A T on one of the assistant coaches for the Suns. 5.35 left in the third, Gorgie Zhang. A lot of worried fans here in Minnesota. Good D there by the Suns. Oh, and a ticky-tack call there. Down as Bledsoe rests, has the four fouls, Martin in January here. Yeah, his first basket in the game, and it'll be nice if he can kind of loosen up a little bit. And you know how streaky he can be. He can bring the team right back into it. Single-handedly, as we've seen so many times, Martin brings it. He just knocks it down with that wacky shot. And now you've got to be able to be in the moment. Here's Rubio now. Again, the intense defense, Bledsoe, the flyby by Tucker, and that gives Martin the opportunity. Has produced 30 points. Phoenix's fourth turnover in the quarter, and that's going to be a hard foul. Martin hits the deck. Martin has 23, he's 10 for 11 from the line. The Wolves 31 for 36, 86%. They got to the line an awful lot, too many times in the first half. And he makes both. Well, these two are too many times in the second half.